Toma, agarra tu, tu cerveza. by a couple subscribers and I thought I would pretty much vlog today today tomorrow because I'm having a friend visiting I also want to reorganize my vanity uh, my vanity is the Hollywood style of vanity with drawers on each side um, three drawers down the middle and a clear glass top so you can pretty much see inside um, of the three upper drawers and I have not organized them for a while now probably about a month um, since I started refilming and excuse my hair but like I said I'm in the middle of doing this and trying to get ready to go pick her up so yeah what I'm going to show you guys is pretty much what I'm doing at the moment so let me show you real quick what I'm going to be uh, doing okay so pretty much I emptied out this drawer and I'm going to put all my face palettes in here and the reason being is that all my loose shadows and pigments are in another, like, not acrylic container, but other drawers on another part of my room. And I want to put them all in the first drawer, which is that one, which is a lot slimmer. You can see that one. Too. and I need to clean the edges because I got makeup all over the place um, pretty much because I'll be filming and smudging things everywhere so I need to organize all of this this drawer right here this one is pretty much screaming help I mean this is supposed to be a lipstick drawer and it is, I mean, brushes, uh, eyeshadow palettes, highlighters, pigments, um, mascaras, you name it. It's a huge mess. And as you can see, that's what I need to organize and make pretty. Oh my god, I even have earrings in there so I need to do that and I'm going to show you guys what I did with this drawer is pretty much try to fit as many eyeshadow palettes as possible I know it's going to be a challenge when I'm looking for a certain palette but I mean I need these upper drawers because they're the ones that I can reach 
so yeah that's what I, I did I transferred all the ones that were on the other uh, empty drawer that I showed you guys and I put them in here and then in this one what I did was put all so I put all my larger eyeshadow palettes in here and some of the smaller ones that are just not going to fit in the other drawer and then what I'm going to do now is clean that middle drawer and I will um, pretty much lay everything out as soon as I clear that top part of the vanity. Alright, so I'm going to place all of these eyeshadows and pigments, glitters, all of this stuff into the top drawer. So one of the smaller ones on the side and I just think that it'll be easier for me for when I'm trying to create more uh, creative or dramatic glittering looks. So that is what I'm going to do. So as you can see, I have some Stila, Super Beauty, MAC, uh, Bisu, Eye Candy, uh, Makeup Forever. So yeah, I'm going to transfer all of that. I'm going to begin to put it in here. I do want to like um, add like some type of paper, uh, like wallpaper or something, contact paper, some type of paper um, to protect the drawers. But right now um, I don't have any, so I'm just going to put them in like that and hope for the best. Alright, so as you can see, I was able to fit every single glitter and pigment and single eyeshadow. Now, I did have to stack the Suva Beauty ones and the Dose of Colors just because that was the only way that everything was going to fit. And I really dislike how dirty my NARS eyeshadows look but I mean they get really easily dirty uh, so yeah that's you know I'm going to try and clean them somehow uh, so yeah I have my Stila um, glitter eyeshadow um, and my Urban Decay my Dose of Colors my MAC Pigments and uh, Bisu, um, I talked about them in a previous video um, and I really like their uh, glitters. They're really, really affordable. They're like less than one US dollar here. And I just, you know, have bought a few but I do plan on buying more and other ones. And yeah, that is pretty much it. And I feel like this drawer now looks a lot better and I can easily just open this up and be a little bit more inspired this way. This one is done. Now for this drawer, I don't know what to do. It's like such a huge mess, but I mean, I was going to try to make this my everyday drawer, but there's just so many liquid lipsticks that I wouldn't know where to put them. So I guess I'm going to have to let it be a liquid lipstick drawer for now. Um, this one I think I'm going to put off until tomorrow just because I'm really tired now and yeah. Ay, mi esperanza, ¿cómo tarda? ¿Cómo tarda? Ya apúrate. 
Sí, mira, como tú te levantaste y te empezaste a pintar, ¿verdad? Yo no tengo derecho. Estoy sonriendo como si se viera la sonrisa. Salió por aquel lado, Marita. Un molcajete, por favor. Sí. ¿Qué están dos? Sí. ¿Tú? Ranchero. No ranchero. Sol, maceta, al pino, alacrán, rana, rana y valiente, diablo, barril, carta, mira, se me olvida ganar, la rosa, da? Da igual yo por aquí, para las cuatro, y el esperoncito, no, yo gané, ¿qué ganas? ¿Qué ganas? Cuatro. Cuatro. Bien. Ahí está. ¿Quién ganó? Qué foto tan no, fea no, me no, tomaste. No me gusta de ver. Ah. Me siento mal. Ahí está, gracias. Lotería. Ahí está la mila de, de la esperancita. Búscamelo. Tú solita dijiste, ahí está en mi maleta. Me la voy a poner. Okay, I completely forgot to put this in the drawer. This is a glitter glue by Adora Cosmetics. I didn't like it. It doesn't work at all. This is like such a failed purchase. Uh, so... I'm just going to, I don't know what even to do with it, I mean, I really don't feel like it's of any use, it's, show you guys, so it's supposed to be like a wand applicator, I tried using it with a glitter, and then I also tried using it with a pigment, I tried using it with like a foiled eyeshadow, um, and no, it just doesn't work. The MAC Mixing Medium, which is what I love to use for glitters and pigments, um, I then, you know, I'll go get the NYX one. I know that I can find the NYX or the MAC one somewhere here. So, um, 
going to try to buy one of those. So I'm over here drinking a coffee. These are like, I guess you could say like the Starbucks wrap, frappuccinos, the, um, the ones that come in the glass container. They taste pretty much the same, but they're um, from like, uh, I guess, what would be a 7-Eleven for us in the U.S. Um, it's called uh, something else here and this is one of those mocha frappuccinos. Um, so it's just pretty much an iced, or not an iced, but a cold uh, coffee and it is really good. And I've been buying these a lot for like filming days just because I feel like it gives me that extra energy that I need when I'm feeling like I'm getting that burnout. So yeah, I've been drinking these. And I, oh, and I quickly want to explain because there is going to be some footage of me drinking some type of alcohol in the vlog. But it was um, Mexican Independence Day here on the 16th of September. And I mean, like I said, my friend was visiting and me, my boyfriend and her decided we would um, try a bunch of different drinks. So we, I mean, we had different types of uh, beers and different types of like uh, alcoholic beverages that are more like sweet. Um, we just wanted to try them out and see what they taste like. Um, and no, I was not drunk. So I just wanted to put that out there just because I feel like Sometimes people get like, I don't know, like um, surprised when they know like I, I mean, I'm not a drinker, but I'm, I guess a special occasion drinker. Or if I'm in the mood to drink, have a drink, I'll have a drink. But you know, it's never more than a glass of wine or something like that. But it was, like I said, Mexican Independence Day. I don't think I have ever celebrated Mexican Independence Day here. So to me, it was like something new, you know? So yeah, I just wanted to explain that because I, I was like, oh my God, what are they gonna say? You know, Ruth is drinking and no, it didn't, it's, I mean, it's, just the occasion and it doesn't harm me in any way uh, at all. I can actually drink. Um, I am, you know, legal to drink so it's not a problem. Um, and yeah, I'm an adult. I'm a responsible adult. So yeah, I just wanted to explain that. Yeah, just wanted to tell you guys that.